Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. To enable Wi-Fi in Windows 11 and view Wi-Fi settings in Windows 11, open the Settings app window and then click the Network and Internet button at the left side of the screen to show the network and internet settings for your computer to the right. To enable Wi-Fi in Windows 11, click the Wi-Fi toggle switch that appears to the right to toggle it to the on position. Alternatively, to turn off Wi-Fi in Windows 11, click the Wi-Fi toggle switch to toggle it to the off position. Alternatively, to enable Wi-Fi in Windows 11, open the Settings app window and then click the Network and Internet button at the left side of the screen to show the network and internet settings for your computer to the right. Then click the Wi-Fi setting button to the right to show all your computer's Wi-Fi settings at the right side of the Settings app window. Then click the Wi-Fi toggle switch that appears to toggle it to the on position. Alternatively, to turn off Wi-Fi in Windows 11, click the Wi-Fi toggle switch to toggle it to the off position. To show the available Wi-Fi networks to which you can connect in Windows 11, click the Show Available Networks Settings button within the Wi-Fi settings to expand it and show the available Wi-Fi networks. To connect to an available network, click it to select it. To connect automatically to the selected Wi-Fi network in the future, leave the Connect Automatically checkbox checked. To only connect manually, uncheck the checkbox. Then click the Connect button to connect to the network and enter any security information in the window that then appears to join the Wi-Fi network. To view the properties of the joined Wi-Fi network, click its Settings button that then appears at the right side of the screen. Here you can click the Connect Automatically When in Range checkbox to toggle automatic joining to the Wi-Fi network when it is in range, either on or off. To set the network profile, select either the Public or Private Option button in the Network Profile Type section. The Public Network Profile is recommended for most networks unless you know and trust all the users and devices on that Wi-Fi network as the private network profile allows for device discovery and file sharing between network devices. To indicate that this is a metered connection, click the metered connection toggle switch to set it to the on position. To enable or disable random hardware addresses on the network, select either on or off from the random hardware addresses settings dropdown. To manually assign your IP address if needed, Click the Edit button for the IP assignment setting. Select Manual from the Edit Network IP Settings dropdown. And then click to toggle IPv4 and or IPv6 addresses on or off by clicking their toggle switch buttons as needed. Then enter the manual IP address information for the selected type of IP address into the fields that appear and click the Save button at the bottom of the window to finish. Likewise, to edit the DNS servers for the network if needed, click the Edit button for the DNS server assignment setting, select Manual from the Edit Network DNS Settings dropdown, and then click to toggle IPv4 and or IPv6 addresses on or off by clicking their toggle switch buttons as needed. Then enter the manual IP addresses for the DNS servers for the selected type of IP addresses into the fields that appear and click the Save button at the bottom of the window to finish. The Wi-Fi connections information appears at the bottom of the Settings window, and you can click the adjacent Copy button to copy it to the clipboard if you need to send it to others for network troubleshooting. To return to the Wi-Fi settings in Windows 11 when finished, click the Wi-Fi link in the breadcrumb navigation at the top of the Settings window. To disconnect from a Wi-Fi network you have joined in Windows 11, click the Show Available Networks Settings button to expand it if needed. The Joined Network should then appear in the list. Click the Disconnect button for the Joined Network to disconnect from it. After you join a Wi-Fi network in Windows 11, that network is then known by Windows 11. To manage the known Wi-Fi networks in Windows 11, Click the Manage Known Networks Settings button in the Wi-Fi settings to show the known networks in a list. To manually add a new Wi-Fi network to join in Windows 11 if needed, 
Click the Add Network button to open the Add a New Network window. Enter the network's name, also called its SSID, into the Network Name field. Then select the security type for the network from the Security Type dropdown. Depending on the choice you make, then enter any security information required to join the Wi-Fi network. To connect automatically to the network in the future when in range, check the Connect Automatically checkbox. To connect even if the network is not broadcasting, check the Connect Even If This Network Is Not Broadcasting checkbox. To save the network, then click the Save button to add it to the list of known networks. In the list of known Wi-Fi networks, you can click a Wi-Fi network's Settings button to view and edit its properties as previously discussed. If you view its properties, then click the Manage Known Networks link in the breadcrumb navigation at the top of the page to view the listing of known networks again. To forget a known network so Windows will not try to join it again with the saved settings, click the Forget button in the desired Wi-Fi network's Settings button. To return to the Wi-Fi settings in Windows 11, click the Wi-Fi link in the breadcrumb navigation at the top of the settings window. To view and edit the properties of your computer's Wi-Fi adapter, click the Hardware Properties Settings button to show those hardware properties at the right side of the window. You can click the Wi-Fi Properties button to expand and collapse the adapter's properties as needed. To edit the adapter's IP assignment or DNS addresses, Click the Edit button for the IP assignment or DNS server assignment properties as needed, and then enter the information in the windows that appear as previously discussed. To copy the Wi-Fi adapter's hardware properties if needed for troubleshooting, click the Copy button next to that information in this window. To return to the Wi-Fi settings in Windows 11, click the Wi-Fi link in the breadcrumb navigation at the top of the settings window. To enable random hardware addresses for the Wi-Fi networks you join in Windows 11, click the Random Hardware Addresses Settings toggle switch to set it to the on position. When enabled, this also turns on the same setting for the Wi-Fi networks you join. To close the Settings app window when finished, click the X button in its upper right corner. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www dot teachucomp dot com forward slash free